In this video, I'm going to teach you how to convert multiple chart to a single view chart and connect them with the slicer so that you can change the slicer button. It will show you those chart. And the best thing is there is no VBA code needed. You just need to develop your charts and I will show you the method. Just follow them and develop a nice, beautiful, compact dashboard. No further ado, let's go together. Consider we have dashboard on which we have multiple chart. The goal is perfectly align those chart one by one first. So I'm just hitting Alt key and moving the chart to align on column C. The next thing I will select all of the chart, go to shape format and the height in this case 2.92 so that all of the chart exactly the same size. Now I'm going to move all of the chart one below one. I'm pressing Alt key and moving the chart and this will perfectly align all of the chart for me easily. Now the next thing I will select all of the chart, Control A to select, right click, format object, make sure that move and size with cell is selected. If this is not select, this method will not work. Now we will create a dummy table and with this table we will exactly type the name of the chart. So from row 4, annual revenue trend chart start till row 17. From row 18, seasonal snowfall chart started. Seasonal snowfall and I will copy paste all of the name till row 31. From row 32, actual versus target chart started till row 45 and I will do this for the rest of the chart. If you have more chart, you can do this method step by step. Now we will convert all of this data into a table format. I will select all of the data, control T, my table has header, hit OK. This will create me a table. Now I will go to insert, insert slicer and I will just insert my slicer. The next thing I will select slicer, slicer sitting, display header to uncheck. And now I will a little bit format as well my slicer off the grid line and heading. And now if I select my actual versus target button, any of the chart, this will show me respect to chart. I will just hide this column as well of the heading and this is how we can create simply this nice dashboard. I hope you like this video. If you like the video, please subscribe my channel for more video.